Wow. Rest in peace to Akira Toriyama. We in the cave. <laughs> Drew Titan, Bear Cave Entertainment. Oh man, man, man. This this one is this is bad. Um for those of you that don't know, man on this screen is Akira Toriyama. Akira Toriyama. Um this man is a legend. He is a legend. Um born in Japan uh, he's a manga artist um, people over here stateside knowing him for his great work in a cartoon called Dragon Ball Dragon Ball Z Dragon Ball Super Dragon Ball movies uh, I don't correct me if I'm wrong. And for those of you who are more uh, rounded at this conversation, um, I don't think he had anything to do with Dragon Ball GT as much, although those were his characters. But this man is a genius. He is a legend. Um, and he passed away. He passed away. I'm just not finding out about it. So I want to uh, give him his flowers. You know what I mean? Um, wow, man. This this guy is an absolute legend. Um, he's responsible, like I said, for Dragon Ball Z. Uh, Dragon Ball, when it was just, you know, Goku as a child. And then Dragon Ball Z, was you, you find out about his uh, heritage and where he's from and who he is. Uh, reviewed some of his work. Um, he also had a uh, uh manga out called uh what was it called dr slump yeah i i always used to see this a lot i just never knew what it was and i didn't know that he did this until uh, a few years ago i said oh man you know so this guy is uh he's been around um what is it i'm reading here on wikipedia it says he earned in 1981 the Shogo Shogo Shoga Kukan Manga Award for Best Shonen Manga with Dr. Slump. There it is right there. Selling over 35 million copies in Japan. And this guy is an absolute rock star, man. An absolute rock star. Absolute rock star. Then he did Dragon Ball. I think that what is it said? Is it 260 million copies worldwide, man? This guy is a rock star. Um, designed the character for Dragon Quest. This is a character designed for Dragon Quest, Chrono Trigger. I heard all of these Blue Dragon. Um, you know, this is a uh, this is a loss, man. This is a loss. He's been in the industry since 1978, man. 1978. This man has been around, man. Uh, the the uh, Doctor Slump series was from was from seventy eight to eighty three. Dragon Ball was from eighty three all the way up to nineteen ninety seven. You know what I'm saying? Uh, wow, wow. It says here that Dragon Ball GT, like I was saying earlier, um, it wasn't based off of Toriyama's manga directly. You know, um, he was he was still involved with it to a degree. You know what I mean? Um, I'm just breezing through this. I'm just giving this man some flowers here, man. This is, I just read this a little while ago, man. I mean, this 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 guy, Akira Toriyama, is uh, a legend. Manga, he's a legend in anime. And this is a loss, man. They need, in Japan, they need to put up a statue of this man. Um, You know, give this man his roses, man. He has two children. Uh erect the statue of uh, Akira Toriyama. He was the age of 68. 
68 years young. I don't know if he had any, you know, health issues. I didn't really read the articles. I just saw an article saying that um, he went home to the Lord. And um, I just want to give this man his roses. And uh, man, this is this is rough. This is rough. And uh, I don't even know what else to say, man. Uh, live through his work. Um, if you have manga or anything signature with a signature on it, hold on to it. Um, I'm a huge Dragon Ball fan. I have the actual Japanese toys. I have them in storage. I don't even know if you can, other than eBay, I don't eBay. I don't know where you would find those. Not the American ones, the Japanese ones. I have those. I have a lot of them. I have a whole lot of them. And salute to this brother, man. Um, been watching this work since the eighties. I have. I just, I didn't know he did uh, uh, Doctor Slump. I had no idea that was his work, man. A salute to him. And uh, wow, rest in power, good brother. And thank you for all your work, man. We in the cave. <laughs>